Hello all. Uh, today I'm gonna show you uh, the tutorial for how to transmit data wirelessly between PIC controllers. So I am basically using a Zigbee uh, Pro S2B uh, wireless module as my radio transmitter and receiver. So this breadboard setup is the same setup which I have used in the tutorial for serial communication. So if you don't know how to make the setup, please go back and watch that video. The link to that video is just popped up on top of the screen. So the uh, TX pin of my PIC controller is being connected to the TX pin of my Zigbee. This red board is called the Zigbee Shield, which you can get it in from market. And it also has a voltage regulator which converts the 5 volt to 3.3 volt input, which is required for the Zigbee. So I am giving a 5 volt input and it's ground and this is the ground so i have the uh, receiver setup here in which also i am using a zigbee uh, pro s2b series so when you are using zigbee modules make sure that you are using the modules of the same series because uh, series 1 zigbees won't com communicate with series 2 zigbees so here also i have uh, given the same connection to the zigbee shield but only changes the RX pin is connected to the RX pin of the Zigbee. So and this is also the same setup which I have used in the serial communication. So right now I'll just uh, power this up and we'll show you how it's working. So now I, now I uh, powered the microcontrollers and the Zigbee shield with the batteries. So as you can see when I press the key here, the data gets transmitted from this Zigbee to the receiver Zigbee and accordingly based on the data received the LED glows so as I press the switches the corresponding LED glows so make sure that you configure the Zigbee modules using the XCTU software which is easily available in the net and uh, one uh, Zigbee should be configured as a configurator while the other should be configured as a router and make sure that the serious high low con address of the Zigbee is loaded as the destination address of this and vice versa. Uh, the link is available at the description for the details of the video. Thanks for watching. Keep subscribed.